Hello everyone, I'm Matzep, and welcome back to Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Last time we made it to uh, this place, whatever it's called, the Jubilife City, I think it is. Um, and we beat up some Pokemon along the way, got uh, Edgy Boy uh, in our Poke Pokemon party. Yeah, Edgy Boy or Shinx. Um, also, I just realized that we have a level 6 and a level 9 Pokemon. So that's pretty nice, <laughs> but uh, anyways, uh, and then we also got the the poach the Pokemon watch that in the top upper right that's covered that's like almost a webcam on <laughs> how big it is. Um, yeah, and then, oh yeah, we also got this town map. Ooh, okay. I actually like how this map looks color wise and everything. Reminds me a little bit of a Monster Hunter map, but like not too much. Um, okay, so Sand Jam Town, uh, Twin Leaf Town. Okay, this is much easier to control by D-pad. Canalave City, uh, Floroma Town, and o Orberg City. Okay, that's where I have to go next. I, I really appreciate that the game is like, here's the next place to go in the story, because that just kind of helps me figure it out. <laughs> Um, and I'm sure it also helps a lot of children too, but okay, so if we have to go this or we have to go this way, I think Oh gosh, not dweeb again Hey, Mazam, tell me you got a little tougher Me? Do you even need to ask? Of course I got tougher. Come on, let's battle it out Okay, our first rival battle, I guess We're challenged by Pokemon trainer dweeb <laughs> He has a Starly. Oh, man. You're about to be absolutely decimated by my Jeffluquius. Starly is a level 7. Ow. Okay, yeah, he's no match for my. I mean. Don't get cocky, kid. This is. Like, kid. We're like the same age, dweeb. <laughs> I think. I, I would assume so. Okay, yeah, nice. We killed the Starly. And uh, EXP, uh, Edgy Boy leveled up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's about to say a twerk twig. Um, okay, so. Is electric good against grass? No, in fact, it. it the attack is have Oh, this is not good. <laughs> uh, well, I guess the, the uh, well, is grass effective against t uh, grass is not effective against electric. So if I s if I switch to Edgy Boy and have him just tackle the thing to death, then we should be fine. Although the Tur Turtwig is higher level, but so this might be a little in intense for Edgy Boy. Okay, just keep tackling him. Edgy Boy, use tackle! Oh no. <laughs> okay, yeah, the uh, Edgy Boy's not gonna last very long, but we're gonna have him do at least a couple more tackles here. Gotta, get, gotta give Edgy Boy some action. Yeah, withdrawal. That, oh no, D defense up, oh jeez. Ah, tackle! Gosh, I'm, I'm doing even less damage, man! Oh wait, hold on, okay, I can use... Edgy Boy's getting kinda low in health, I'm gonna use Leer. Leer is a defense down, so it should counteract the... Uh, withdraw thing, at least somewhat. Or, well, okay, just use it again. <laughs> That's also kind of a jarring move because it just like it changes the camera to show him just going inside the clamshell and then it just cuts back to here. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. Leer. <laughs> Gosh, stop using withdraw. It's like he, it's like uh, Dweeb is hearing me or something. <laughs> He's like, okay, if I just keep using my defense move, I, he won't be able to lower. Turtwig's defense too much. 
Okay, this is just uh, an endless cycle. The turt twig is broken. Man, I, it kind of shows a rough start here because, like, none of my Pokemon are effective against grass type Pokemon. <laughs> um. Okay, gonna bring throw out the the potion, on Edgy Boy. And I'm just gonna have him, I'm gonna try to have him keep using Leer. If this, if he would stop spamming withdraw, oh my gosh. I can't handle the, all this freaking defensive garbage. Turtwig is already in the advantage in type and stuff, and yet they're just like, oh, withdraw. Oh no, he's at like 75% health. I must use my defensive move constantly. <laughs> is that some weird like uh, programming thing where it's like they lower the chance of him using tackle to try to make the game easier on players? Uh, okay, I'm just gonna freaking punch him. Not gonna deal like any damage, yeah. Gosh, she's worse than a freaking uh, Metapod. <laughs> it's just only defense. Yeah, I mean, if you're just gonna keep using Withdraw, I might as well just keep punching them. What are you doing, man? <laughs> this is the lamest rival battle ever. Well, he's just spamming his turtle mode. My Pokemon's eat. Oh, okay, I didn't get to read that. <laughs> Jeez, I don't give you any time to read. Like, you don't even get to click through that. It just automatically happens. Ow. Okay, he's probably going to use Withdraw again. Or... He, the, this uh, AI for Dweeb is smart and is saying, hey, I am out of, uh, or I, I can't raise his defense any higher, so let me just keep spamming tackle. Ouch. Um, that being said, I kind of don't want to have Edgy Boy get hurt. Uh, I think Edgy Boy can survive one more hit. <laughs> Come on, Edgy Boy. Use tackle. I mean, okay, no, he used tackle as well. Okay. Oh, the, the sound doesn't keep going? Finally, they fixed that. <laughs> um. Okay, no, I gotta, I, I'm gonna keep Edgy Boy out because, like, uh, because of the, the type advantage stuff. Although, well, okay, here's the thing is that Turtwig's not using any sort of grass attack. And, you know, tackle's just a normal type move. So, I probably should be fine to use Piplup. Or, excuse me, Deflucleus. I'm just gonna keep tackling him. Um, yeah, here, let's bring in Deflucleus. I'm probably gonna get slapped with some grass type move now. I like Razor Leaf and just one shots Deflucleus. I'm like, oh no. Or you can just keep using Withdraw. Jeez, how can its defense keep going up? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, this is... Yeah, honestly, this is like... It's, I was hoping for, like... I, I mean, I wasn't expecting anything, like, super, like, explosive or amazing, but this is so boring. <laughs> Let me just spam the uh, withdrawal button. Uh. He's got to run out of PP sometime, right? Dweeb, don't you dare use a freaking healing item. Even though I'm just going to use a healing item on Jaflucius. <laughs> Uh, so how is your guys' day going? <laughs> Mine's going pretty good. This is actually the last day of 2021 for me when I'm recording this. 
And you know, 2021 has been a, it's been a year. It's been kind of a ridiculous year. Like regardless of your political standings or whatever, 2021 has been pretty insane. Yay, Turtwig died. <laughs> we finally got this battle over with, jeez. Never fought such a cowardly player. <laughs> well, to be fair, I don't play. It, it, it's a, whatever. Oh, it, I overcomplicate and overthink things, okay? It's just a, it's a trainer. I've never fought such a cowardly trainer. That's what I meant to say. Anyways, moving on. Okay, Jaflukwius is 33 HP now. That's pretty cool. Edgy boy. Doesn't get any special attack or special defense upgrades at level 8. But he's got a little bit more health. Oh, and he learned Charge. Okay. I don't know what that does, but... What just happened? I lost? Okay, here's a thousand bucks. He just slaps a stack, a stack of cash in my hand. What? What do you mean I lost? Well, that's it. I, this, that's the last time I'll ever lose. I'm going to be the world's toughest trainer, and you know it. The first thing I got, uh, the first thing to do is take on the Orberg City Pokemon Gym. I'm going to toughen up for that totally. Okay. Anyways, now you can see that it's eight o'clock. Uh, wait. That, okay, no, yeah, eight. That's my brain. It's military time on the, 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 the watch, so I... I have to convert that in my head. Oh yeah, are these Pokemon trainers? Uh, we just did a trainer battle. Let's, well, let's see some of the Pokemon in the region. Oh wait, I probably should have healed. Also, it's another Shanks. Can I just like leave? Can I, can I just like go home? <laughs> go back home to mom. Okay, run. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Glad that they, they never added any animations for that. Okay. I got to go heal up my Pokemon. Because uh, I assume that they're low on health. I don't know. We're already at the Pokemon Center, so let's just do that. So... Let's go. Not this way. Actually, let's grab some more potions. Because uh, I used up quite a few, I think. And who knows, maybe we'll get some other cool items. Like Pokeballs and Heal Ball. I never really understood the other the ball types. Uh, oh geez, I only have one potion. I'm glad I'm going here. Uh, let's just buy nine. I have a total of ten. Yep, I can put those in my pocket. Let's get some Paralyzed Heals, because I might need those for the Shinxes. And who knows what else. And then I got yeah, 28 Pokeballs left. Okay. Um, geez, is there a way to, like, turn off the Poke Watch thing? Like, I don't mind it being there, but it's a, it's a, it's a little in intrusive. Like, I'm not used to there being this big clock in the corner. Come on, show me something. There we go. And it's another Starly. I guess we could pick up a Starly, right? Nah, I don't want a Starly. I want something cooler. Let's kill it with your water gun, Jaflukius. So, I, I do wonder if there's going to be anything more with that red... Gyarados, because that was kind of, that seemed to be a big thing at the beginning of the game, and so far they've done nothing with it. <laughs> Just been back to normal Pokemon game. Oh, what's the sign say? Trainer tips. Okay, yeah, well, PP stands for power points. I guess that makes sense. I still don't really understand why they're called PP instead of, of like, something else. Uh, ooh, Abra. Interesting. Okay, I was not expecting to see an Abra of all things. Um. Okay, I know Abras like to run away. That's kind of their gimmick, right? So if I just punch him, what happens? 
Okay, he almost dies. Okay, and he's gone already. <laughs> I was hoping that maybe he would have waited until his second turn to teleport away. So maybe I could try to catch him, but oh my gosh. Ah, Shank's okay. I like how obvious it is that the, the mouth is just like a image that's just put on the 3D object that is the Shinx's head. <laughs> I mean, it, it makes sense. There's no reason to like make it actually a 3D model, but... I don't know, it stands out to me for some reason. Uh, let's just use water gun. Shoot it with water! That almost killed it. Come on, Jaflukius, you got this. Just punch him. Okay. Okay, Edgy Boy's a little nine now. Nice. Uh, oh crap. Okay, I guess we'll do this trainer battle. Some of these trainer battles feel kind of like you're forced to go to fight them. <laughs> Is that just me? Like, I don't know how I would have avoided this one. A level four Bidoof? Are you trying to insult me? Like, a level four Bidoof. Seriously. <laughs> okay. Sure, man. Or, sure, girl. That... That makes sense, you know, just send out a level 4 Bidoof. She, had to, she does have two other Pokemon, so maybe the other ones will be better. Uh, but do. Uh, what is this one again? Okay, yeah, it's this guy. Okay, Water Gun's not gonna be very good, because I think this is a grass type Pokemon. I mean, it looks grassy, it's green. If it's green, it must be grass type, right? His attack is rising, but it probably won't matter because this punch will probably just kill it. Yeah, there we go. I mean, it's a Badoo. What do you expect? Starlet. <laughs> Come on, give me something more interesting. Come on. They're all level four. They're almost... Or, all three of those her Pokemon's levels combined is only two levels higher than my Fluke is. <laughs> No, fun math fact. <laughs> Can't figure that out. <laughs> and Jafluku is leveled up. Nice. Okay. 35 HP. And you learn Charm. Okay, what does Charm do? I need to actually look at my moves. Because there's some new ones that I'm not sure how they work. Uh, such as Charm. Look at that first. Um, check summary. And then we go over. Oh, my Jaflukus is the naughty nature. <laughs> what does that mean? I know there's natures and they do something with. Oh, wait, does it actually tell you that it increases attack and lowers special defense? Is that how that works? I, I don't know. Again, I'm not like any sort of like. Uh, even novice at natures. I'm below a novice. I barely know that they are a thing in the game. <laughs> okay, charm. Okay, it doesn't uh, use this case. Charm really make it less. Harshly lowers the target's attack stat. So it's, it's basically a better growl. But uh, it's fairy type and does has less uh, PP. Does the type for stuff like this matter? I don't feel like it does. Oh, I can move the, the moves around? That's pretty cool. Doesn't really matter a whole lot, but that's pretty cool. Uh, okay. And then... Oh, Thundershock. Or, yeah, Thundershock. Okay, it's the same damage as Tackle. Uh, but it can cause Paralysis, which is the good part about it. Uh, and then Charge. This the user boosts the power of the electric move it uses on the next turn. This also raises the user's special defense stat. Okay. That's nice. So, basically... It's useful for making Thundershock better. Uh, there's always these, like, buff moves. I usually am one of those people that just go full on, like, all attacks moves and stuff, but that's interesting. 
And then, yeah, there's, gosh, there's just the whole thing with, like, special attacks versus regular attacks, and it's confusing, but... I mean, it's just, like, magic attack versus, like, physical attack or something, right? But... I don't know, sometimes it's not so clear on which is which. Also, I'm going over into this patch of grass because I saw there was an item thing. And I wanted to get it. You know, gotta pick up the, the cool items. Ooh, a critical hit. One shot the Starly. Nice. Good job, Jaflukius. Just carrying the team. Because AXP share is on. Jeez, there's so many encounters. <laughs> Why is there so many encounters in this game? It's too much. Too much, I say. I don't know, maybe it's fine, but... Feels like a lot. Yep, and kill the Starlight again. I can one shot it even without critting it. Game is baby mode. Okay. Jeez, okay. Repel! Yay! I, I do really like repels, and actually I feel like they're probably something that should be used in a lot more RPGs outside of Pokemon. <laughs> Where it's just like, I don't want to fight anything, please just ignore me. Because repels basically turn off in random encounters for a while. And it's honestly kind of weird that it's not used in more games. Oh my gosh! Just stop at the, the ra Oh, it's a bit of okay, never mind! All these random encounters paid off! We can get a bit of in our party! If I don't one-shot him. Oh gosh, only level four? Okay. Um. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go with Edgy Boy. Because Edgy Boy is lower level, so you know, lower level equals lower stats. I would assume. Hopefully, it's low enough. Okay, intimidate just lowers the attack stat, which is fine. I mean, I'm not intimidated by this Badoof at all, so I'm even less intimidated now. Um, I guess let's use tackle. Oh, I, I guess it doesn't really matter. Come on, Inchy Boy, hold back! Okay. Um. Ow. Okay, so here's a question is... Well, I, I could at least try to use a Pokeball here. I'm not sure if it will work. I'm just kind of worried that... That... Uh, Edgy Boy's gonna crit him. Because we've been getting a fair amount of crits so far. Hey, we got him! Nice! <laughs> we got the Bidoof! <laughs> okay, Bidoof's gonna become our main character now because he's the funny Pokemon! I actually kind of don't really like Bidoof as, like, the meme, but... Uh, I'm just gonna call him... <laughs> meme. But it's spelled wrong because it's funnier that way. <laughs> meme was... It's like men. Men the edge into party. What does Mem have to uh, add to the party? Just tackle and growl? Okay, yeah, you're probably gonna be replaced soon. <laughs> I don't know, just we gotta get the funny, the funny, uh, funny ha-has out of the way. Um, are we going to go into a cave? Oh no, I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, you're talking about my poked? You're st p still a pretty new trainer, aren't you? It's all good, you're a new fellow friend of Pokemon. Now let me make a, a gift of these technical machines to you. Uh, TM98, like, S as in, like, I think the iPhone, like, 13S or whatever it's called. <laughs> whatever the new iPhone is, or is it plural? <laughs> TM98s. Each of these TMs contain the move Rock Smash. FYI, when you use the techno techno technical machine, sorry, I got a lisp, to teach your Pokemon a move, that TM will then break. So think very carefully about when to use it. I also add a new feature to your Poked Rookie Trainer. It's the Hidden Moves app. Use Rock Smash from your Poked, and a wild Pokemon will get rid of boulders in your path. Wait, what? 
a wild Pokemon. But to use this hidden move in the field, you'll need the, the fir you'll first need the gym badge from Orber City. I'm looking forward to seeing your growth. Okay, use. So I don't even need the Pokemon. I just need the, like, oh, okay. I forgot there's Ram counters in the cave. Wild Zubat. Okay. Here's finally some like really, really different Pokemon. A water gun. Yeah. So apparently we just don't need like. And we don't need the Pokemon for the TM, we just we need the TM itself. I'm I'm confused on how the Pokey the hidden moves thing changes th uh matters. Uh, I don't I feel like it wasn't very clearly explained. <laughs> Mem is level four. Okay, excuse me. Oh gosh, another encounter. We're gonna be getting into encounters like the whole way through this cave. Uh, another Zubat. Am I gonna already have to start cutting major chunks of the episode? We just get into a random encounter after a random encounter. Yep, it has the, the drain life thing, yada yada. I just keep water gunning it, just look we is. Yay, a mem leveled up. Now he finally has or he finally has defense curl, okay. That's useful, I guess. Excuse me, coming through. <laughs> I love just going around them like that. I mean they're they're positioned to be going walk around, I guess, so. You know, why not take that advantage of it? Uh, okay, so another Zubat. I guess there's just only Zubats in this cave. It's a little boring, don't you think? Oh, Super Sonic. Uh oh, that makes. Yeah. Jafluke is just confused now. Uh oh. Uh, okay, so with confusion, I know that it, there's at least a chance to hit yourself, but is it guaranteed to hit yourself? Or like, how does it work exactly? Yeah, Jafluque is... Okay, no, Jafluque has just punched himself. This is not good. Oh, Astonish. Oh, okay, never mind. That, that wasn't as detrimental as I, I thought that was going to be like some power move, but no, it's fine. Okay, let's bring in Edgy Boy. Edgy Boy is not confused, so maybe Edgy Boy will be able to actually perform better. Oh, Zuban's ability countered uh, <laughs> Edgy Boy's Intimidate? That's actually kind of cool. I didn't know that was a thing. Uh, Thundershock! Yeah. That's actually... That's a decent animation. I kind of wish that there was, like, a travel from Edgy Boy to the Zubat, because it kind of looks like the lightning just appears on the Zubat, but that's eh, whatever. Yeah, Edgy Boy's level 10 now. Nice. Edgy Boy's gonna probably evolve soon, right? And Jafluquius, for that matter, actually. Um, okay, we're finally at Orbor City. Heck yeah, I think that's probably gonna be it for- Oh, wow. <laughs> Howdy, trainer! If you don't have a single gym badge, other trainers will look down on you like you're a total noob, right? You know, with the, uh, the zeros instead of an O. So I'll show you where the town's Pokemon gym is. I guess this is kind of nice just for the sake of like new players knowing what the gym looks like. But of course, it's the same thing could be said for the Pokemon Center and Pokemon Mart in the first episode. I feel like it's pretty obvious that this is a gym, but I don't know. Huh, there's someone there. Yep, here's Dweeb. What's up, Dweeb? Huh? Oh, it's you, Mazam. You finally got here. You're slow like always. You're so slow, the gym leader's long gone now. He said he had to go, uh, oh yeah, to Orbury Mine. I got my badge already, so it's no big deal to me, but... It's a big deal to you, so... Okay. <laughs> Anyways, um, okay, well, that changes things. Was the place that we just... Hold on, I wish I could... I wish I could zoom in. 
I can't. Okay, so where's Orber Mine? Am I able to see that on the map? Is that this place over here? No, that's a Turna City. Okay, I guess that's nowhere on this map. <laughs> hmm. Okay, wait, location info. Oh, okay, we get to learn about, like, the berries and stuff? That's interesting. Um, okay, we'll, we'll figure it out. Um, what the hell was there? Check map. Oh, I guess I'll just go down to that spot. We'll, we'll figure it out, but um, we'll figure it out in the next episode. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, all the good stuff. And if you want to check out more of what I do, go follow me over on Twitch, as well as the YouTube Archive channel for my Twitch channel. And if you want to keep up to date on all things Metsup Gaming, go follow me over on Facebook and Twitter. Links to all that stuff in the description down below. And I'll see you all in the next episode.